Hello everybody, this is me Ethan here and welcome back to another LEGO haul video. If my voice sounds a little bit different, it is because I just woke up about an hour ago and I still am a little bit tired. But today I have my Kohl's haul to show you. I noticed that a lot of people had been getting LEGO sets early from Kohl's and some people have been getting some deals. So let's go ahead and get right into it and show you the deals I got. Also, new setup. I'm not super happy with how it is. I can't really perfect the infinite white yet. And there's still a lot of wrinkles, just don't mind it. It still looks decent. It's a lot better than what I've had. So the first thing that I got, I don't know if it'll fit in the frame, just a little bit, it is the um, LEGO Movie 2 Emmett's Dream House slash Rescue Rocket. I got this for $14. That is right, $14. 706 pieces for $14, I think is great. The build is awesome, and you also get the Rescue Rocket. There's a lot of like details inside and stuff. So I basically got 706 pieces for $14, which is absolutely insane. And I'm super happy about that. A lot of great minifigures. And this is one of my most wanted LEGO Movie 2 sets and most wanted sets of this year. And that was the only good price thing that I got. And what might surprise you is that I got this newer set for $20, and I got that one for $14, but that's because this is, of course, a newer set. This one's $20. This is Duel on Mustafar. I really like this one. I don't really like the red, but I think it's a cool play set, not really a display set, but more of a play set. And I do like the minifigures. You get Obi-Wan Kenobi and Anakin Skywalker, and I, I just thought it was a really cool looking set, and it's one of my favorite Star Wars movies of all time. But the sad thing is that Kohl's likes to put stickers on um, sets, so I had to take it off, and now it's got a bunch of sticker residue. And I forgot to mention with the Emmett Streamhouse Rescue Rocket that it was initially 70. I can spin it around. It was 70 there. So that's, what, 75% off? I got it for 14, and it was 70. Yeah, that's 75% that's off, so that's pretty good. So there is Duel on Mustafar. And also my calculations for Emmett's Dreamhouse Rescue Rocket. Then the next thing I got for $10 is the LEGO Star Wars 75264 Kylo Ren Shuttle Microfighter. I really like this microfighter. This is one of the best microfighters I think we've ever had for Star Wars. And it's, it's just really cool. As you can see, there's that sticker right there that bothers me so much. And it's trying to brighten up on me again. But yeah, just an awesome minifigure to get for 10 bucks. No question about it. I just think it's really cool with the red cracks. And of course the um, actual microfighter itself is like a super iconic ship and all. So that's cool. So for $10, I just thought it was a steal. They didn't have any of the new battle packs there, which is a bit disappointing. But that's okay. And then the last two things that I got are the LEGO DC minifigures. I believe I do know which ones these are. Expect a video coming out soon, as well as the stream finishing off the LEGO Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker Millennium Falcon. I'm pretty sure I know what these are, but I'm not going to tell you. You guys are going to have to wait till the video, but these were sadly $5. I was hoping they would be 4 but nope. So there's my haul, and then I also forgot to mention that at Kohl's right now, if you spend $50 on pretty much anything, you get $10 Kohl's cash. So I spent 50 right here because this was 20 14 um, 10 and then 10 right here. So I spent, I believe, like $55 or something like that. I spent a lot of money yesterday, but just for that good deal alone, I think it's completely worth it. And also all the brand new stuff that I really wanted. So tell me what you guys think about this haul. It's really crazy. I hope there's more deals like that one at Walmart because I've been seeing some people get it. Um, for just really good deals, like just a bunch of sets for really good deals. So I hope I can find some like that. So tell me down in the comments down below if you got any new stuff for 2020 and what you want for 2020 and what you just thought of this haul. So I thank you all so much for watching. Please just like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye and have a great day.